way, MTV. Could it be? Could it be over here somewhere? Come on, buddy. My crib! Ah! I knew it was here somewhere. Come on, let's go inside. Welcome to my crib. Okay, this room here, if you look around, is kind of like the greenhouse slash platinum house. These are uh, all the slate to the grind platinum records. I wanted something for my children, okay? I, I didn't come from uh, a house like this. I wanted to give them uh, a life that I would have liked to have when I was a kid. So um, it's, you know, more for them, actually, because, you know, they're my buds. I love them. Come on in here. Let me tell you what I watch on TV, you freaks. They've got a new channel. It's called MTVX, mother trucker! This is a painting done by, can you guess who did that? David Lee Roth. If you could have told me when I was 12 that I'd have a painting by David Lee Roth on my wall, I would have said, no, I won't. It's my family portrait that was done by my father. Uh, they used to have my uncle in the middle, but then when he divorced my aunt, my dad painted an Indian chief right over his head. My dad also did this here of Jesus Christ and a nice sunset. There's some sort of metaphor in there somewhere. It goes well with the autographed Judas Priest poster, don't you think? Oh, come here, check this out. Every house needs a Gene Simmons vomitizer. You see, I wouldn't feel complete unless I had a ceramic contraption that puked blood 24 hours a day. This is my chick. Here's the fridge. We got a couple stickers. I know I have something in my fridge that no other person on this block has. On the Kiss reunion tour, when Gene spat blood, here's the cup that he threw into the front row. Blood. Still viscous for your viewing pleasure. It still has some of the confetti soaked in blood in my fridge. All right, man, here's my CD room. When I walked into the record store, I go, dude, I want one of these. He goes, which one? I go, I want the wall, brother! I got the crew, I got Van Halen, I got Trouble, I got Exciter, I got Kiss, I got Ted Nugent, Weekend Warriors. I listen to it all, man. Come on in, here's my bathroom. I just stole this off the wall of uh, Conan O'Brien. <laughs> Rip. And this is uh, a collection of 70s memorabilia. We got uh, Captain America puppy stickers, John Lennon doll. Here's a really cool thing I gotta show you behind the door. This is an original Gene Simmons Halloween costume. Every house needs a Ted Nugent truck. <laughs> it's not a home unless you have a Ted Nugent truck. <laughs> Come into my uh, bedroom here. This is a Kiss sleeping bag, which I really dig. And uh, the Kiss sleeping bag protects the Kiss pinball machine. <laughs> this is my bedroom. Here's my closet. Now these are my Jekyll and Hyde clothes. Here's my smoking jacket. This is a red snakeskin thingamajiggy. Come on, mother trucker. This is Mr. Hyde's jacket. <laughs> this is the um, office, so please excuse the mess. You might think collecting comics is uh, kind of silly, and it is, but... Some of these comics are worth a lot of money. Fantastic Four, number six. This is worth about 
I don't know, two grand. Here's the Incredible Hulk number three. This is worth about $4,000. This is the very first appearance of Spider-Man. This comic is valued at about $25,000. And of course, this uh, fireproof cabinet. So if like I lose all my house, I come back and I still got my comics. <laughs> Come on in here, dude. Check it out. I bought this car in 1990 from the drummer of Extreme, Paul Geary. But this car not only has Kiss stickers right on the side, this Camaro is autographed by Ace Fraley. You don't have one. I do. Here's my 1970 Rally Sport. I got this like three years ago and uh, put it in some shows, actually, and uh, actually won. Here's the uh, jam room in here. Let me take it, take it, Parents, come on, we have to kick some ass right now. Those fathers yell at their kids to clean their room. I order him to kick ass. Dude, what up? How's it going, man? <laughs> Well, MTV, thank you very much for coming to my crib. Rock on. Y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs>